Dog passes in the villages are, uh, it's our central nervous system. I mean, it's uh, everybody it comes and goes through there. Vice Mayor Doug Andrews is concerned. He understands the sand migrating into Johns Pass is not only choking the channel, it's choking the boardwalk businesses. It's incumbent on us to make sure that that we try to keep our businesses afloat and keep everybody moving through there. That was the sand all the way up underneath the boat. We first introduced you to Captain Dylan Hubbard last week. His family's marina has been in John's Pass for decades. He tells Eight on Your Side he is hopeful this dialogue will lead to a resolution. Every day we get a little bit more momentum, more eyeballs on the new website, SaveJohnsPass.com, more people signing up, begging for more information and how to join the movement. The quick fix would be dredging the area again, but the sand will eventually come back. The longer term and more expensive solution would be extending the jetty. And if the bust for businesses isn't enough, the added sand is also creating for dangerous currents for anyone in the water there. Johns Pass is now taken over as the number one water rescue here location in the county. So it's an issue.